Okay, Paul, here we go. Got your frozen water here. Look at this. It's even frozen on the ground. 20 degrees out. So that's been going for about an hour in 20 degree weather and really cold water in the boiler. So it's running good. Got the blower all hooked up here. You can probably hear it. Moving a lot of air through there. And of course, Here's your connection for your air if you want to use that. But it has a good draft, so uh, I wouldn't think you'd need it all the time. Uh, let's see, on the pump here, we've got the airlock valve right here. Once you've got water coming out of it, you know there's no air in the pump. You know, because down here in the pump, a little bit of air gets down in there sometimes. And when I ship it, I'll drain it over the water. So, uh, and this is your fill and drain here. And then, of course, your engine out is back here. And this pop-off valve, and I'll run it up and down a couple times, is set at 100 pounds, I believe. So, looking good. It fires real good. Draws real good. Uh, whistle will go here. That's a half inch out. Got your tricox right there. And your water sight glass. One thing about a boiler is always make sure there's water in it first. These two valves are just to be able to turn off the water. If say uh, you want to uh, flush it out, the tube that is. Uh, there's a valve at the bottom. Or if the glass breaks, which is highly unlikely. Back on farms that happened occasionally, so they put those on there. Yep, real nice. Big firebox there, 14 inches deep, 14 wide. Even out here in the freezing cold, it still fires up real nice. And I've only got 40 pounds on it now, so I'll run it up to where the valve pops on it a couple times. And uh, so she works. Draft door down here. You know, it's got air moving around the bottom of it. I don't even need to know if you need to open this one or not. But I always leave them open about an inch. And uh, I'm just running some old uh, oak here from an oak barrel. Um, just some pieces of oak, some maple and cedar to start it with. So it's a great boiler. It's going to be nice. Doesn't leak at all. It's perfect. Talk to you later.